and we are Team BU. So at the beginning of the forum, we were given a global design challenge of dealing with the world's waste as to not compromise our future water resources. We then narrowed it down to reduce the pressure and demand on fresh water resources to keep it sustainable for future generations. Uh, throughout the course of our thinking, we wanted to ensure that our potential solutions would satisfy the following criteria. One, the solution must be able to be implemented in our schools and communities. Projects should be open to student and community involvement. The solution should be affordable and achievable. And LEGO is now going to introduce our first step to solutions that we can each bring to our own communities in a different way. Um, hello everybody, I'm LEGO from Thailand. So the solution we come up with is um, the water club. This club will teach people on how to use the water properly. And we have green water harvesting and using grey water for flushing. Also, we have a reward system so we can convince people to join us. Um, this solution is just some example from our common country problem based on our discussion because different countries have different problems. So each of us are going to be the ambassador of the water club in each country and we can keep in touch whether it's changing in a good way or bad way. So, I'm Udo from South Africa. Uh, the first uh, probability we explored is rainwater harvesting. And this can be imp implemented in two different ways. If the school is willing to fund it, there will be rainwater tanks which will, be, which will collect rainwater and in certain areas like South Africa where the drought is really bad, we can transport it to areas uh, which no longer have flowing water. Or for example in India where there's not enough clean water, they can use it themselves. Uh, uh, the other solution uh, is if the school is not willing to fund uh, water tanks, there will be something with cash water 